I'm looking at it as a new challenge, yeah. basically. But it didn't turn out to be a challenge. It turned out to be more of like, I feel like part of a journey I have to go through. So you felt very com very comfortable, sorry, I in did. front of the camera? I, I did. I was on TV before. Actually, I when remember um, Compass, first year I did a show, a Compass show, basically. Oh. More would go to Compasses and just see events and talk to Compass kids. That was Compass 101 on Urban. Oh. Then, it was still new then. Okay. We're the ones who started. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and then I felt like, nah, I needed to focus. And then after that, I, I left. But then after like two weeks, I get a job at UBC. Mm -hmm. with, I'm like, that wasn't, that, was, <laughs> that wasn't hard. Okay. So I'm like, okay, I can't say no to this. Because it wasn't really as pressing. Well, you've been on TV for a minute. I have been on TV. <laughs> and then th the only good thing is I've managed to be who I am despite and in spite yeah, of whatever. You haven't have to fit any boxes. I've not tried to. Yeah. I don't want to fit in any box because I feel like if I do, then, then I won't be able to are. grow and I lose who I am. And who I am is what I have worked to be. Yeah. Oh, what were you doing at McCary? I was doing QS then. Okay. And then now I am doing IT because okay. I wanted to do some. Oh yeah, I keep looking for challenges. That is the biggest problem with me. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's explain. What, what? I, do you switch just, your course or no, are you finished? I finished and then, and then I looked for something else. Okay. That is mm -hmm. totally different. And it's also a whole different ball game. I just keep looking for challenges. I think I'm just that kind of person that wants mm. to try out stuff. If I should call it that. Yeah. And I keep watching, no, I'm sorry, I got the idea from movies. Because I keep watching movies and for being so smart, and the IT guys are like, chick, 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 chick. and I wanted to be that. <laughs> that's, that's, it's not exactly like that. But <laughs> that is what I thought. I people end up doing IT for that. They're like, I it's what I be thought this person. I was going to like, be doing, like the whole coding and you see numbers like running all through. Not exactly like that, because mm. <laughs> I've had a but whole are you different... enjoying it? Yeah, I have. And the whole, a whole different experience. Mm -hmm. And half the time, I'm like looking at people and they're like, hold up, you look familiar. I'm like, are you sure? <laughs> like, do <no>. tell. <laughs> I keep trying to see. <laughs> I keep trying to see. Because half the... I keep doing my thing like basically everyone else, mm -hmm. hoping that no one will try and treat me like mm -hmm. different or whatever. Though when people actually do know, then they treat you then different and I don't want them to do so. Yeah. So I'm like, how am I going to be able to just keep doing that while being or now what I would say as the, one of the hugest platforms yeah. around? Well, it's one of the things that comes. So yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful feeling. I'm, yeah. I'm getting to learn a lot of different things, to learn how to be female. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <geez. laughs> <laughs> I think about it and just doesn't, you carry yourself in a different way, then you have to now attend this. Um, we had a staff party and everyone is all doing the whole gowny kind of thing. And then I walk in in t shirt and jeans, and they're like, Yeah, that's her. Because <laughs> like, okay. they know it, but other people are like, Hmm, we need to get her someone to dress her up. Because if you leave me to do it myself, you can't have a hard time. Yeah. But it has been a good side to see. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've grown now. Yeah. And I'm still growing. I'm still going to be pushing myself. I'm looking for my next challenge. Well, I'm still going to be pushing myself mm. and to try my best. That's <laughs> nice. I mean, you also went through a very traumatic experience. Yes. So the courage that you have now also comes from the fact that at some point you were probably I was broken. trapped. I was actually broken. That's, no, that's the only way I could word. use to explain it. I literally was broken. <laughs> I didn't know. I, I would remember there were times I would I would cry, the kind of cry that you s <laughs> lose breath. <laughs> mm. And I remember that. And sometimes I think about it, I'm like, hold up, that was, I went through all of that. Yeah. So and you've I'm come like, out on the other side. I've and come out on the other side, I'm like, this is a good feeling. <laughs> it's a good feeling. It's hard to believe it's a good feeling. Mm. To be able to actually be happy and not, it's not a show. Like mm -hmm. you're actually happy, you, you actually feel it. It's for real, you're not just trying to tend to be happy mm -hmm. or putting it. I actually am at peace now. I feel like everything is okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's, it's good and I just hope it keeps getting better. Okay. <laughs> so are you dating? Yes, I am. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have to say that, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's up to you. <laughs> it's really up to you. Is it I serious? Am. Is it 
I'm more of a serious kind of person. Mm. How did you meet? On Facebook. Oh my God. <laughs> you know what I was just about to ask you? Somehow when I was talking to you, I was remembering a conversation I had. Because I remember, I think on radio a few years ago. Yeah. I was talking about like, what's this business of people coming to your inbox? You know, your DM and yeah. they're like, la 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 la. And I'm like, that's not the way to meet people. And then I was put in my place by my co-host. <laughs> He shared this article of all these people who yeah, have actually. stories and testimonies of how they met their significant other on sliding into someone's DM. Yeah. And then, and then now you tell me Facebook. It was Facebook. What? But it was funny. How? That was years ago. So like, like yes, you did I not know this person care. at all? Nope. Um, okay. He made so a snarky comment. Oh. <laughs> I looked for the human being. <laughs> <laughs> Like, hell no, you don't just say that to me and walk away. <laughs> no. <laughs> I look for it. I like, wait, because he made fun. Ah, I have um, a very weird way of standing when I'm comfortable. Okay. So I just like, I stand, my feet will literally face anywhere. And now I'm okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is the one person I actually noticed. Okay, I think maybe other people, other people would notice it, but don't really say it. Mm -hmm. No, this one actually says it to me. I'm like, like what do you on? think you are? So yeah, we start talking. Just talk and talk and talk and talk. And I'm being dumb and he's being dumb and just keep talking. <laughs> it was okay. And I was still in that particular phase where things weren't really okay. Yeah. So it, was, it felt good to have someone that you could talk to It just doesn't, you can't judge, doesn't know everything. Yeah. And then at the end of the day, you ended up being the only person that knew everything that I had actually gone through. So you were able through. to share that with him? Yeah. Wow. It's actually the same person that took me to church. Oh. So yeah, it was, it was awkward. It was very odd. And even getting myself to tell him about it, I was in cover there, I remember. Yeah. And it was like those trips that you do with friends and whatever, and we were staying with like my friend's family, and we're many. <laughs> like we're, we're actually doing childish things, which I would advise people to do. Mm -hmm. We're pl doing day would play games, like games that you would not remember, mm. dodgeball and that kind of yeah. grown people playing yeah. those games. Yeah. And then at night we'd watch old movies. And it was more of like a high school kind of vibe. They would separate okay. us. Like boys stay upstairs, girls stay downstairs kind of thing. Where we sneak into the upstairs still because that's where the network was. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it was. So it was, it was a whole different kind of feeling. And that was the time I actually got to just relax and felt like I could actually tell someone okay. my story my story and what had been going what through. What you were going through. And he didn't run away. <laughs> so, <laughs> yay. <laughs> yay. <laughs> it seemed as weird. So, it was awkward. Oh, but it took a minute. That's nice. That's nice. Not that it has been perfect at all. I mean, it's a, like, I do not want to ever see you again. But. So this is a few <laughs> years then. <laughs> it is. Mm. Well, that's nice to hear. So, Still would you advise other people? To date or Facebook, into the slide into the DM. <laughs> it depends on how you're doing. If, yeah. you, if you go in all snarky and stuff. One thing is about how respectful you are. And yeah, because you could meet, it could be a friend. Mm. He could be a friend. He was my friend for the yeah. longest. He still is just my friend. That's yeah. what I see here was. Yeah. <laughs> but then I also in the world today, if you even just look at how online dating has yeah. taken over, even here in Uganda, I keep hearing stories about people who but met people online. People take I'm it like, to be, you know, they, they treat it different. They feel like they have to gain something from it. Like if you approach a girl, you have to be willing to give her something. If mm. you, you get it, I feel like if a guys, they, they want something out of relationships and I don't feel like you're supposed to go into a, a relationship uh, looking for something. Mm. You would notice it just happens. Yeah. I think we're not going in, I have to get this girl, I want to marry this particular type of girl. Then you look for that exact type of girl on Facebook because you, in your mind, the girl you want must be light skinned. She must have this type of body. She must have gone to this school or, and then that's what you're looking for. And mm. yet the girl that you would actually be able to mesh with is probably Maybe totally different, different. Yeah. and people are going in with super high expectations yeah. and I 
that's the only problem. They, they say for a lot of women that's been an issue. When yeah. Women have lists. Like, and they're like, they oh, he has to be this, he has to be this. He has to be this. And the lists are things that don't matter. The things that should matter are, you know, someone who is trustworthy. Yeah, who will be able to take you yeah. in as you. I was who's shocked caring, that you, I would mm -hmm. tell someone what I was going through then. And they didn't see me as weird. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> and most of my own friends, I don't think I would have shared with them as easy. Yeah. I actually wouldn't. Because you think you're like, you Cause look you said at you people. weren't telling anyone about nope. it. None. And that's a lot to go through. I'd and I'm happy, happy you're happy. I'm you're happy. You're in a good place. Yeah, right now I'm in a good place. And you keep pushing myself. yourself to try new things. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> yes. Okay. It's, it's a good feeling because I have learned to love myself now. Mm -hmm. Actually, that was, that's one of the things I've been trying to readjust to. Paying attention to who I am and loving who I am and not seeing myself as a weird person. Okay, stop calling myself that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I, I'm thinking, <laughs> you're labeling yourself. Mm. I used to actually, I'd be like, I'm so weird. Why would like someone would tell me they like me? Like why? Why would you? Um, uh, I'd brush them off mm. because I think I don't. I'm not deserving, and I had to learn how to see myself as deserving of, of the good things and of happiness and everything. It takes a minute though. Mm. But, but yeah, I'm still not good with the whole compliments. <laughs> I can literally run away. That's as bad as it is. You'd find me fading away into the background. Like, where, where did she go? Like, what can I do? <laughs> like, slowly take one step, two steps, and I'll look for something. I'll be like, I'm looking for something. Because mm -hmm. at times they get a bit overwhelming. You're out, like, let me say, with your friends, and yeah. people will come around and start saying good things. And you're like, OK, stop. Yeah. <laughs> like, OK, stop. It'll take me a minute to adjust, yeah. I guess. Well, it will take. Just say thank you. Yeah, it's a compliment. And I, I always think, you know, people don't have to come and appreciate you and point out something. So yeah. in a way, it's, it, it's really, really it's a beautiful thing. When they it do. is. When you get to see it that way, then you learn to adjust to the whole, mm. okay, yes, <laughs> thank <laughs> you. Okay, yes. <laughs> yeah, it takes me a second. Though. Mm. At some point, I just go into the whole screensaver mode. I'm just like, <laughs> screensaver I mode. stay. I just stay and keep looking at people. I'll just laugh because I don't know what to say. I freeze. I know what I have to say. I'm supposed to be saying thank you. When I freeze, nothing is coming out of my mouth. Just looking at people. Well, well. I did my first uh, beat mic, and people were actually asking to take pictures with me. I'm looking. I'm like me. <laughs> <laughs> you had to take a picture with me. It didn't make sense. Yeah. And then I do the second beat mic, which is just um, last uh, two weeks ago. And now the number was like increasing. And I'm like, you don't realize there are people there that have been in the game longer than me. Why don't you want to take pictures? <laughs> Why are you asking me? Mm. I'm still not used to it. And they're like, no, I want to take a picture with you. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Well, enjoy it. It just—it it takes a minute. I, yeah. I don't know how you've been doing it. I'm saying I should be asking you really how you've been able to handle the whole. Oh my God, I'm your fan, and you're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> you're my fan? No. <laughs> but I'm learning. How to, I'm learning how to be my own number one fan. I guess. Okay. Well, we're excited for you. Excited. We'll keep watching your journey. <laughs> see you push yourself. Yes. I'd like to see where you are in like the next five years. I'm not going to ask you I, I where do you see yourself. I do not know where that will be. I know. Things can change in a, in a snap, like where you think you're going to be. Because yeah, uh, it changes just mm -hmm. like that. You never really know what's going to happen. Things True. just switch. Yeah. But I'll keep my fingers crossed. Right. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Well, thank you again. <laughs> thank it was you. such a pleasure. <laughs> it was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>